here is our winch in action. It is just a winch from Harbor Freight welded to a stake bar. Here's from my vantage point getting the first pole up. I'm controlling it. The other guys are under. Now that we got one up, I was able to set the camera up and we got the vantage point of inside the tent for the second and third center pole. And there's, yes, there's a bunch of leaves on the bottom of this tent. God damn it, it doesn't matter. They'll dry, they'll come off. But I was highly annoyed at all these leaves. So you just get the center pole in, move it up to the winch plate. And this winch plate is from Raise It with a Z, R-A-I-Z-E dash I-T, raiseit.com. And then I go back out to control the winch. You can get a remote controlled one, but I was just doing this real quick, seeing if it would work. So I bought just a cheap one from Harbor Freight. We have two commands, go and stop. So that's the only thing that is yelled. I'm just waiting to hear go or stop. And then once it's up, you just pull it off. It's usually easiest to kind of just twist it off. And then you reset for the next one. We just kind of move the tarps out of the way, make sure the path is clear and get going. Now this video is only sped up by two, so it's pretty accurate on how long it takes. But even if by using this winch, it takes a few minutes longer, what it really does is keeps everyone from hurting themselves or getting too tired out. This just makes a 40 wide just feel like any other tent. It's just easy. There's nothing hard about this now. The hardest part was manpower center poles. Now that we have this winch, no one dreads a 40 wide. It's easy now. Yeah.